Hello world, it's been a while. I thought I'll, I'll stop and make a post and I'll show you why. As you can see, I'm cycling around again. And in this time of year, it's normally not the intention that we should. But um, I am. You know why? I, I do not have a house. So, um, so I cannot stay at home, as they say. I know I stayed with my brother for a while, but um, after two weeks with three kids, um, it's quite busy. So I had to think of something. Um, so what I did, I, I tried to contact family and friends. I wanted to do some volunteering work or I make myself useful. And uh, well, um, somebody reached out to me and asked me if I could help. I'll, I'll tell more about that later, but that's not the point I'm starting this video. So as you can see again, I am on my bike. I am fully packed. And uh, what I noticed, I traveled around. I've been cycling for an hour. That's one of the reasons I stopped because I'm really tired. <laughs> I haven't cycled, cycled for a while. Um, so I wanted to stop because I'm tired but another thing I wanted to point out as well is people see me cycling with my bags and they I don't know they look weird at me they think I'm traveling uh, or do something wrong I don't know but I have no idea where I'm going so I'm, I'm surprised that I'm being judged before they even have spoken a word to me um, just before I started my trip in Europe I I cycled around my friend 1400 kilometers and my parents 600 and if you met people they said hello at least I you know, a little wave or something but um, I don't know there's many people I look at look behind me there's many people out many people out but nobody says hello to each other why because of the virus is that the case is that how creative we are uh, everything is wrong now nobody everybody's contagious or what is it <laughs> maybe I just met the wrong 50 people or so I really don't know but uh, it just really surprised me so I had to stop for that reason as well I wanted to say something about it because it really surprised me um, I really hope we all get more creative because of this because we have to things are not as they are normally I heard people say I don't know how to celebrate my birthday why because you can't invite anyone it's strange there's many ways to celebrate you know because things are not as normal doesn't mean that I have to be boring or I don't know I don't know, it just really surprises me some reactions that people have. Uh, hopefully many of you uh, can deal with the situation in a good way. But um, yeah, I think we need to get more creative and appreciate more what we have. And I think this virus is doing that just for us. But anyway, I don't want to nag on too long. Um, I just wanted to say this. Uh, people, if you see me, yes, I am on a journey. I do not have a house. So I will always be on a journey for now, <laughs> until I find my home again. And uh, please do not judge. Uh, please, please do not judge before you've spoken to the person. That will not only change the world of the one you're judging, but your own world as well. It makes it a lot easier, believe me. So anyway, there's another reason. There was one I was tired of biking. Second one I wanted to record this one. And the third reason is that one. I am back in the Netherlands and we do sell fish haring. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get a haring. Enjoy that one. Keep cycling and then you'll find out where I'm heading to very soon. So thank you very much. Stay happy, healthy and a big hug. Cheers. <laughs>